hello mj squad welcome back to another video another youtube video if you're new here kindly consider subscribing to my youtube channel down below and also hit on the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever to another whenever i upload a new video and also don't forget to give this video a big big thumbs up okay so on today's video so on today's video i'll be stretching my hair i've already like stretched this part like this half and also this back section so i'm remaining with this cut section so i'm left with this section i'm going to like blow dry this section with you and this section i've done and then this other section i've done so so you can see like literally the difference like you can see like the difference of the stretching and i'm just going to take you through one of my ways how i stretch my hair and if you don't have a blow dry i have another video on that on how you can stretch your hair which is the simplest i think it's the simplest yeah the simplest if you maybe can plc or may decide hakuna steamer and you want a stretched look i have that video will it will pop up at the end of this video so this is the section that i'm going to do and the product that i use i use this curling cream and then this hair oil and water as my l this as my c and then this as my oh, this is my o so l c o so i'm using that method if you can you ever either use l lock l o c or l c o anyway if you this is the oil that i'm using but if i was my blood my blood dry was like having that high temperature and all i would have used this ors uh heat uh protectant yeah but anyway i'm sorry for the background noise so now what i'm going to do i'm going to like uh like divide this into two because it's a big section and then i'm going to put this one aside like so i'm just putting my mirror so i can see okay so this section is the one that i'm going to be dealing with let me just put this one a little bit further behind so it doesn't disturb me yeah so this is the section that i'm going to be working on and you can see like shrinkage is real so like my oil uh, if you have leave-in you can use instead of water so and then i'm going to apply my my i'm going to apply i'm going to apply my uh I don't know if you can see this is my cream and it's very thick it's very thick as you can see i'm going to take a little of that so if you have high porosity here no worries like products will just suck in the product that you are going to use but if you have you have low porosity you need to massage like the product in in your cuticle so that the product doesn't sit on your what do you call on your hair just like it penetrates yani you get like everything so i'm just applying it in this section And then I'm going to take my my oil. So so now that I've applied whatever I'm supposed to apply, now my hair is moisturized. Now I'm going to take my blow dry. Don't mind this. This is just blood done in my ear because 
when I <laughs> this blow dry, this is the blow dry that I'm using. This is the Safeway Professional Soft Touch one. 1800 watts AC, so it's not that high temperature. So it has like two settings. This first one, it has a max. Oh god, this it has like um, what do you call it? It has like I don't know if you can see it has. So here it has zero and then max. I don't know if you can see this max and then. This one is now the on button. You can hear like the the Saudi blood drain increase. So this when I not when I purchased this blood dry I was gifted by my dad. So this blood dry ilikuje kiona these two things and Ali by when he was traveling. So hatunge like Rudisha because it was outside Kenya. Now, I was still new in this journey, so someone else, Alikuja Kanyambia, like she has like these two things, these uh things to easy is gonna meet it, and I was actually planning to buy this. So, uh, the blood red that she used, high fit na my blood red, so that's why I use this bladder to like hold it in place and it works for me. So, since then, CJ like consider to buy another thing. Of this but I'm going to plan to do that so near to shamba anyway <laughs> but this is an invention so now let me sh oh my god the light man oh. so let me just show you how I do it so at this point I'm going to detangle this section over here and then I come and we start blood drying So now my hair is fully and this is the like the remaining and I still have shebe on my hair. Oh my goodness. But that will stay there anyway. So I've like um uh, I have so I have just um what do you call it? Detangle you can use a deming brush if you have and also if you have a way through comb like me. I don't have a deming brush, so now let's start with the drying. So uh, depending on the settings that you want to do if you want maybe medium and medium you can do but for me I normally go with both marks because the heat for medium for both it's really really low and I like spend a lot of time stretching my hair so that's why I just go full on um, full on marks but if you have a blow dryer which like has a lot of heat like you know a lot of heat use your blow dry medium it just depends with the blow dry that you use the settings that you're going to put over here it just depends with you so now now let's start blow drying so i'm not going to talk because it's going to be a lot of noise a lot of noise. section is really uh, has it's stretched properly so I'm going to like uh, put this section aside and then move to the next section which is this one and basically what I've done to that section I'm going to do the, this remaining section over here yeah so again since my hair is dry but if you have to maybe taken a shower right uh, at that moment and your hair is like Damp. so i'm just going to spray some water so this is like my l my cream as my o
and then my oh and then I proceed to the tango And now I'm going to start blood drying. So now when it's like this section is dry, I'm going to like combine this, these two sections and then blow dry them together so that I don't feel like any like I, I blow dry it properly. done with that section so now I'm going to combine these two section and then I'm going to it so my section is like all detangled already for like starting to braid my hair anyway that is it for me and this is uh, just basically how i stretch my hair when i'm in a uh, like i want like asap stretching but if i wasn't in a hurry i would have done african threading method yeah so that's it and this is how my hair is looking i don't know my hair is not growing i'm not like i don't know what am i doing wrong to not retain length but like look at that oh, i'm in love with this but and let's do this the back section so the back section it's like over here and as you can see my like my <laughs> my top is still wet so the back section is over here the front section so they're like equal anyway i don't know what am i doing to the front section that i'm not doing to the back section so that's how i basically stretch my own hair at home yeah and it's all stretched so comment down below if you go to a salon if or if you just go to if you just stretch your hair and how many times do you stretch your hair this year i've really, really stretched my hair like i think four times of which it's not a good thing but i'm not using like like heat heat like flat ironing and all but soon i'm going to do a flat iron hairstyle so this is how the final result anyway thank you so much for watching if you have not subscribed kindly do so hit on that subscribe button down below and also the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my video videos and also like this video and yeah and share to someone who you think maybe this video will be helpful to them anyway i will see you on the next video bye bye stay safe peace